to make amends here. Indeed, he will be. I Indeed, he would have been short of a length video. Beautifully put away through extra cover field. Uh, beautifully cut away by Ryan Fernando. Getting off the mark. Right. And uh, played it into the ground. You could see intentionally wide off that field. Uh, front of uh, the uh, pointer field. Uh, not easy, but he's uh, put it away. He's in excellent form. He had to reach for it. Uh, and uh, he controlled it well. Indeed, I think uh, one of his preferred shots in the Royto as well. He went after anything short and wide. And he used his feet extremely well. Ah, uh, that's what I was just talking about. He targeted that onside uh, the run. I saw him just looking towards the onside. I think he, it was a enough bet on ball to take it to the boundary. I think that should be the plan against any free hit. I think that should be the plan uh, at the end. Especially against the free hit because uh, it's free runs for anyone. Bat on ball and uh, I get runs. So two boundaries. See. Yes, and I think it will be after the after about 12 o'clock we'll see the crowd coming in. So that's nicely uh, swept away to the fine leg boundary. So that's another four for St. Thomas's. Yeah, four men on the offside. That's true. But he's, his concentration is on the leg side. But he doesn't have a man at fine leg. He's got a man at back foot square leg for the conventional sweep. The problem here was that he was drifting down the leg side. See how, how leg side he is. So you'll never have a fielder for that shot. So Ryan Fernando got that uh, 60 in the first innings of St. Thomas. He's coming in right arm over from the Torrington end. Ryan Fernando open space but it's a big nick and that runs down to the third man boundary. So that's another four for him. Well, uh, the batsman's concern but a moral victory for the bowler. I think he was kind of looking to drive with his head up. The foot drop not really getting to the ball. And uh, a thick edge would have been a simple catch to someone placed at wide edge slip, maybe a second slip. But at this stage of the game, Royal quite uh, content to go with the defensive. This time he looks to go over the top. That's a stylish stroke from uh, Ryan Fernando. He uh, hit the gap beautifully and uh, with that boundary he moves on to 30. He's got five hits to the ropes now, including this one. The second 50 came up in 72 balls for the loss of one wicket. That boundary uh, sort of broke the shackles for the Thomians. Uh, pressure was building on the two batsmen. A few quiet overs and then this happened. Coming in once again right arm um, over the wicket. Both Rhino flicks it off his pads. Beautifully played. Short mid off, a uh, short uh, fine leg and no chance. In the party right now. He could not uh, stray on the leg stump. He did so, and uh, Ryan Fernando was quick to uh, spot that. He knew where the field was exactly. Played it very fine. And uh, that's another boundary uh, to uh, Fernando. He's looking really good into the 40s now. Young prospect to look forward to in the future. And this time, short and pulled away by Ryan Fernando. That's gone to the boundary and that takes him to 49. Good pressure, good attempt for the future. It was a very good shot by Ryan. I think he picks up the length very quickly and uh, moved to the back foot and uh, lifted it over mid-wicket. Very good shot by Ryan Fernando. Ball I, th I think uh, they should uh, wait for the loose ball as they have done this over and I'm sure they will get loose balls. And the Come. And that's, that's 50 for young Ryan Fernando. What an impressive Royal Thomian series he's having. He's making the bat talk as he clips life, gave a few chances, has managed to go to 50. Young, young Fernando. This time a chance for Royal, and this time they hold on to it, and that's a timely breakthrough for the Royalists. Well, he'll be disappointed, deposited anywhere. But the batsman just deciding to hit it down the man's throat at mid-on. Very simple catch in the end. And as you said, Royal will be relieved because the catch has got stuck. Many chances dropped. But this time, well, that tells you a story. Brian Fernando out for a very well-made 51.